I think it does. I think I think um, it's less bad than people think it is. Um, I think people just basically don't like change, so that's part of the problem. The rapid features is part of the allure of 365 also. like. I get a little excited every time I see something new. I think it absolutely is creating some change, but it's also creating a lot of opportunities too once they do figure out how to take advantage of it. Understand what people are concerned about and work with them to let them know it's, it's okay. Here's how you're impacted, here's how you're not impacted. Train the people on the things they need to be trained on. It's all good. Oh, the admins are supposed to train people. Well, somebody's <laughs> supposed to train somebody. They're making things easier to use, uh, more intuitive, and so for the most part, people are welcoming them. When email first came out, everyone's like, whoa, I'm not gonna email it, I'm gonna fax it, right? Having people who like change is really useful. You get to pick your end users? Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> so, not always. So now in this web 2.0 or 3.0 day, it's sort of just making it a part of their everyday lives, sort of like brushing your teeth or getting out of bed. My number one adoption tip is to not be afraid to jump in. Uh, don't let analysis paralysis stop you from using the product and learning and evolving. Have an actual plan, know what you're trying to achieve for the business before you go and try and achieve it. So it's not just about technology, it's about first understanding what the business needs and then go and apply the technology. Clicking around is one thing, but using it, getting value out of it, that keeps you coming back. Right.